Hey guys, it's Anthony here, Super D Service. I got Wayne's truck here. I think it's 05. Pretty sure it's an 05. Uh, doing an air test. It's an occasional hot no start. Uh, we got it hot. I'm sweating like a pig getting under there to get this, get this all hooked up. But it's an occasional hot no start whenever he's towing a load. So I uh, got it hot right now. Temperature's up. And I got the fitting hooked up. Let me turn the light on. Okay, I got the fitting hooked up. Of course not. Let me get the listening tool. Okay, uh, we got the air hook to it. My fitting back there is showing a little bit. Let me show the microphone. Got it right here on the crankcase vent tube. Generally, we'll wait a minute. Over here, a little fill tube. Generally, we'll give it a minute or two, or ten. Leave it hooked up and see if it, uh, see if something pops loose. We'll be right back. Okay, I think my hose is probably about to break. I got a split in it back there. But I keep listening. I have this little tool right here. I stick this hose down in there and put this in my ear and listen for air to come from the crank, from the crankcase. And uh, so far, I'm not hearing any. We're gonna keep it going for a minute. Okay, guys, it's been about five minutes, maybe 10 minutes, I don't know how long. But we got it all quiet in here. You can hear the air hissing from back here, that's from the fitting. You hear it? I got a little cut in this hose. We're about to warranty it out here pretty soon, but uh, here's crankcase tube. I'm putting the side of the phone with the microphone right here on this. Now I'll do the same thing on the oil fill tube. That'll tell us if we got dummy plug or STC fitting. Dummy plug or STC fitting, that'll tell us. I'm gonna call this tight. I mean, this this is this is sealed up. I mean, if it's STC fitting, I don't know. I mean, it is hot. Here, hang on. All right, guys. Uh, I thought I would stick a thermometer down in here so you can see how hot it is. Over 140 degrees. I just stuck a thermometer down in there. We did heat this truck up. We drove it. It was a freaking pain in the ass to get it. Uh, you know, doing this hot is a bummer, but. Sometimes it's what we gotta do. It's up to about 150. So it's 150 degrees. The engine is hot. Uh, we did not do a cold air test. This is a hot air test. So the oil should be nice and thin. So if we do have a leak, it's, it's more prone to find the leak with the oil being hot. Cause it's real thin, you know? And we did pull this uh, oil filter out and it was dry. So this very well could be the issue. We cannot use these filters, guys, period. Cannot use them. This is not the right filter. It, every time you open this filter up and you take it out, uh, as soon as you shut the truck off, the filter starts to drain and you do not have anything in, in the reservoir. That will cause a no start. Absolutely will cause a no start. So uh, we're gonna, we, fit, we wanted to go ahead and do an air test. Uh, we had to make sure. Um, but looks like what we're going to have to do is just put it back together and uh, put the right air, right oil filter on it. And you can see, damn near 160 degrees. I'm just doing that to show that we did heat it up. It is hot. It's freaking crazy hot too. But that's where we're at. We're going to have to ride with it because it's been it's been a while now, and we're yeah. We're going to have to ride with it. All right, have a good day, guys.